Hey there, Luke with Canix here. Today we are covering Canix's Task Management Module. Task Management provides a number of useful tools for operations, both large and small. It helps track and capture labor and non-cannabis cost data to be associated with cannabis inventory. It keeps non-cannabis inventory up to date seamlessly and with minimal manual work. And managers can organize workflows and tasks across multiple teams. We're starting here in the calendar view of the task management module. Canix makes it easy to get a quick view into what work is currently going on at the facility and what work is currently planned. We can quickly see who is assigned to each task, the category of each task with the color coding here, and the status of each task. So we can see that these watering, packaging, and cleaning tasks are overdue with the red clock icon, and we can see these tasks here with the gray clock have yet to be done but are not overdue. This watering the plant task has been completed, so we see a check mark to know that this task has been completed. The tasks table provides a different view into the current tasks we have created for our facility. Here we can see the status of our tasks, so we can see tasks that have been created, tasks that are overdue, or tasks that have been completed and confirmed. Creating new tasks is easy. We can go to create new and quickly pull up the create task modal. Here we can use a template. We would like to pre-fill the data beforehand or create a task from scratch. We can have tasks repeat as well on a daily, weekly, monthly, or custom schedule. We can assign cannabis and non-cannabis inventory to tasks to automate the capturing of costs data and keep non-cannabis inventory up to date with little manual work needed. We can assign cannabis inventory in a number of ways, either by individual tags, by harvest, by location, or by lot ID or production batch. Go ahead and pull a tag here to assign to this task. So we'll take this plant tag, then we can go to our non-cannabis inventory and enter the NCI that is going to be used on this task and the cost that will be applied to the cannabis inventory. So let's say we'll add some fertilizer here. The final piece of setting up a task is assigning the employees who are going to be doing the task. Here we can have a task lead and we can assign multiple employees to the task. We can enter in the estimated task duration we can either apply it to each employee or split it evenly across employees. So I'm going to say this task takes two hours. We'll split it across both employees. So each employee will be estimated for one hour of work here. And the labor costs will be applied depending on their hourly rate to the cannabis inventory that we assigned. Once a task has been created, we will see it populated on the task table and the calendar. Here we can see the estimated start and end date for it and the estimated costs that are going to be associated with the task that will be applied to the cannabis inventory. We can come in here and complete a task. You can see that the task has been completed. Once we go back into the task, we can see that the task was submitted for completion today. We can go ahead to confirm the completion. Here's where we will decide whether to assign the non-cannabis and labor costs to the cannabis inventory that was assigned to the task. So we can see the COGS that were on this piece of cannabis inventory before the task, $0 of total costs. And when we apply the cost, we'll have $181 of costs applied to the assigned inventory here. We can also not apply the costs and deduct the non-cannabis inventory if we would like. We can simply select this do not apply button. No costs will be applied to the cannabis inventory and no non-cannabis inventory will be deducted. We might want to not apply costs when we have a task where a team is collecting inventory, cannabis, non-cannabis inventory to fulfill a sales order or get ready for a manufacturing batch. I hope that this overview of Canix's task management module was helpful, and please reach out to your Canix customer success manager if you would like to learn more.